Hi guys, back again with another video. Now this time we are going to do the sound test of the Jabra LE 65T. Now these are truly wireless earphones, so there are no wires connected to it from the back or anywhere. So uh, these are the ones that I finally bought after going through a lot of different ones, the Sony, the Bose, uh, the Samsung, and then finally I bought this. Uh, I'll tell you the reasons later on. What all are the USBs? Uh, why I chose this over the rest of them? And uh, that'll be a different video, though. So let's do the sound test now. So the first test is the bike test. So I'll be wearing this helmet. Huh. I'll not be wearing a helmet. Uh, then I'll be wearing a helmet with the visor open. Then I'll be wearing a helmet with the visor closed. So uh, the entire sound that you'll be hearing is through these headphones. So let me just show you. Okay. So let's start the test. So let's start the bike first. Now the entire sound that you'll be hearing is from uh, these earphones itself. Now wind does have a lot of problem with earphones. The really sound that you'll be able to hear is the same as the So instantly while I'm talking itself, you'll see that the sound may have changed because I have blocked the sound. So the wind is blocked now, so hopefully you are able to hear me well because the mic is inside. So both of them have mics, so they catch sound separately. So I don't know how the result is going to be, but uh, let me tell you, it's very windy today. So hopefully you are able to hear me well. Let's close the helmet now. Now once you close the helmet there is an echo created, now the echo does not have to be channeled down anymore because there is no mic uh, near my neck, so the mic is on the ears itself, so hopefully that will help because uh, the sound should be clear over here, so let's see how much can you hear me in this. Okay, so we are walking inside the mall now, uh, a lot of people, a lot of sound, no music today surprisingly but... Uh, Okay, so we are doing the sound test in the mall, so we are walking inside the mall, so hopefully you can uh, hear me. Now, there's a lot of uh, sound outside, like a lot of music sound, so that would be coming in, but uh, not many people. So hopefully you can hear me well. Okay, so we are walking outside the mall now, so there are 3-4 uh, pubs around, so a lot of music sound, a uh, little bit of people, uh, so you should be getting a lot of music sound. Quite windy today, even though my hair is not moving, but uh, it's quite windy. So you should be hearing some wind sound, but actually uh, with this earphone you won't really hear much of wind sound because it uh, really does a good job in blocking all the sound. So hopefully you can hear me well. Okay, so we are doing the sound test now uh, near 70 water fountains. So there's a lot of uh, water sound. Now this uh, is actually pretty far from the mouth. So it should be getting a lot of uh, disturbance. Let's see how it's going to handle that. Okay, so mic sound quality on this is excellent. Uh, wind noise is a little bit of problem, but other than that, everything else is fine. Uh, when I was wearing it under the helmet, uh, you could not hear the background at all. Little bit of uh, leakage was there, but other than that, nothing. Uh, normally when I'm riding a bike, uh, wearing this, and I, if I'm speaking to someone, they do not even realize that I'm riding a bike. I ride a Royal Enfield, which makes a lot of sound. Then the traffic sound, they cannot hear anything. Well, uh, while this is under my uh, helmet. Good thing with this is you can uh, use this while you're riding because this has passive noise uh, input. Basically, uh, you would have seen a lot of earphone which talk about passive noise isolation. This allows passive noise to come in. So there's a mode, you double press this and it'll allow passive noise to come in. Then there's a slider on the app, so you can allow, uh, you can choose how much of outside sound should come in. So you will be listening to music, listening to other people talk. I mean, if you're on a phone call, uh, plus the outside sound. So it's safer while you're riding. So you do not, uh, uh, I mean, if there's someone honking behind you, you would be able to hear it with this earphone. So good earphone mic wise. 
Okay, so let's talk about the earphone sound quality. So the earphone sound quality is uh, average. It's not too good. It's not too bad. Uh, if I compare it with other wired earphones or other wireless earphones, uh, which are like bigger, uh, which have uh, a bigger battery, uh, bigger uh, driver. So those give you much better sound. This gives you average sound quality. The sound quality can be improved a little bit with the um, equalizer app that you get with the phone, uh, sorry, uh, which uh, is installed on the phone. So with that, you can improve it a little, so, but you don't get much of a variation in that. You cannot really control too much. So you can just move it a little bit and that's it. But the sound quality is good for uh, long listening. So if you want to use this while you're riding, while, while you're on, uh, traveling and all that, this is very good because uh, you will not get a headache. It's not too loud. Uh, the bass is balanced, the treble is balanced, the vocals are balanced. So you will really like the sound uh, if you're just listening to music. Yes, uh, it, it's even good for the gym. So I have tried it in the gym. Uh, it's good. Um, yes, I would have liked little more volume into it, but uh, it's good enough. So sound quality wise, it, uh, if I look at it uh, with, between uh, 1 to 10, I'll give it around uh, 7. So sound quality, 7. My quality is excellent. So my quality, I'll have to give it 9 because uh, it's it's really, really good. So that's it for this video. If you like the video, please subscribe with the like button and do comment. And I'll see you again with another video. Bye-bye.